Hey guys, so um, I just did this commentary, got about two minutes in and then just fell apart. God, it's so difficult to do these. Um, but today I've got a quick, another quick gameplay on World at War. I mean, I like variety, but this was under five minutes, so I thought I'd upload it and it's an okay score. But um, I can't watch long, long videos on YouTube anymore. I mean, I don't know what it is, but I just get bored, so I don't want to keep anyone on my on my channel for too long so um, yeah I like to choose small uh, short gameplays um, and it is with the MP40 uh, the notorious gun on World of War but it's silenced with camouflage I mean that's probably uh, the least common setup you get with the MP40 I think um, but usually when I do these commentaries um, it's not about the length or anything like that uh, I want to have something to talk about, and um, a few days ago uh, I got deranked on COD 4, and um, although you know I had all my gold guns and my like my tenth prestige, and I could still play, um, it was just a bit annoying, and uh, it made me realise that you know uh, the, these games, I, I don't know where they're headed. Like um, if if Black Ops 2 and you know Modern Warfare 3 they don't get the continued support then uh, they're just gonna end up like uh, COD 4 and World at War and that I think that's just not right like if it's always gonna be about the money and not about the game then um, where can the series go you know like Black Ops 2 20, 20 something I mean where can it go from here without being you know Star Warsy? <laughs> um, and uh, yeah, I've been I've been playing COD 4 and World at War quite a bit, um, but it's definitely not the same. I mean, all the magic has gone um, from you know the hours and hours I put into these games from you know a few years ago. And um, the other night I was playing with uh, District Six or D or Rowan, as uh, some of us know him, and. Uh, it was it was a load of fun, but it's just that it's unpopulated and um, it's it's still simple and it's still amazing, but no one plays it. And uh, although that's that's not really what what's up with COD Four at the moment and um, the Call of Duty series in general, um, it, I don't enjoy BS Three and uh, neither does uh, D. So. Um, we we play Bad Company two and um, yeah it's it's a lot of fun. I think I'm gonna post uh, some uh, videos of uh, us messing around because uh, it seems that only people some people who are still playing that game like they've just bought it and that that's it baffles me. But uh, yeah, we just uh, go in there and mess about with uh, 84s and whatnot. But yeah, it's a, it's. It's still a lot of fun, but um, it's just I don't know where these games um, are going. Like I, d I don't want their you know all these different kill streaks and all of this and all of that. Like it just doesn't compare to you know these simple games. I don't think, and um, well, I don't think they'll ever go back to that kind of formula, and that that's kind of disappointing. And if they're not gonna you know keep supporting these games by removing all the hackers that you see then um, you know I don't really want to be playing them and uh, that just seems like um, a bit of a shame uh, recently I've been watching some of my favorite you know cough or frag movies like uh, Mazadox and um, all those movies by Kata and uh, they really they really show how like Amazing these games can be especially COD 4. I mean, you know when you see the the 3d animations and all of this it, it's, it's amazing like and it and it makes you Remember, you know all the good times that you had on on these games um, I put like I don't know 1400 hours I think into Bad Company. I think D is putting like six billion something like that. I joke with him quite a bit uh, but uh, yeah, that's kind of all I wanted to say about that, um, yeah, the magic's gone, and I don't know what's gonna happen, but, uh,
I hope you've enjoyed the gameplay. Um, I went 22 and 2. Um, my next, you know, like, music -y video is in the making. I got a few more clips to get for that. But, um, yeah, I hope you stick around. And, uh, yeah, thanks for watching.